And yes, so the World Health Organization, WHO, Regional Office for Inside Obodo Africa, Inside the Brazzaville, Congo. Then Samayan said, and currently gets like 609,000 confirmed cases of COVID-19 for Inside Africa. The UN Health Agency been give the update for regional official Twitter account. And the regional office been Samasi, South Africa, gets 287,796 cases and 4,172 people now in do and die. And followed by Abudo, Niger, with 33,153 confirmed cases and 744 deaths. And while Ghana and Sama, 24,988 confirmed cases plus 139 deaths. And it's still young, say Gambia, Seychelles, and Eritrea, now countries we currently get the lowest confirmed cases for inside Africa region. And yes, so on top of Bodo Ibotori, Moderna incorporates experimental vaccine for COVID-19. It shows say it is safe and it did provoke an immune response for all 45 healthy volunteers for the ongoing early stage study for US researchers report on Tuesday. And no study the volunteer experience uh, of any serious side effects, but more than half they report uh, small or moderate reactions like fatigue, headache, chills, muscle ache, and pain uh, for the injection site. And this is now more likely uh, matter than we could still occur after the second dose. And for people who get the highest dose, the team they report for the New England Journal of Medicine. And Moderna are the first to start a human testing of vaccine for novel coronavirus for March 16, some 66 days after the genetic sequence of the virus being they released. And even the United States government, then they support Moderna vaccine with nearly half a billion dollars, and they don't choose them as one of the first to enter large-scale human trials. And yes, so U.S. Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg been they admitted to one hospital on Tuesday, July 14, morning for treatment of possible infection. And one court of stock talk woman, Katie Abberg, summer said the justice they rest comfortably and he could stay for the hospital for a few days to take a colobi intravenous antibiotic treatment. Ginsburg, maybe 87 years old, be initially they seen for hospital inside Washington, D.C. on Monday, July 13, 9th, after experiencing fever and chills. And she still undergo procedure for John Hopkins Hospital inside Baltimore on Tuesday afternoon to take a clean one bile duct stent when they placed last August. Ginsburg, the court oldest justice, a summer series of health scares uh, for recent years. And last May, she still undergo non-surgical treatment for one gallstone with been cause bad infection and yes yeah, so um, we will come back to summer business story after this break we'll return just now <music> 